guys welcome back to my channel for those of you guys seeing my face for the very first time my name is esmeralda but most people like to call me esme and if you guys aren't yet subscribed please make sure to hit that little red button i would really really appreciate it so one of the types of videos that i can remember watching when i first started watching youtube was actually the what's in my bag what's in my book bag what's in my purse types of videos and i don't know why but i've never filmed one myself so that's what i'm going to be doing today i'm going to be showing you guys what i carry in my purse how i organize my purse and and hopefully it gives you guys some tips or some inspiration to organize your purse in a certain way so without further ado let's get into the video so this is my purse this is the kate spade j medium satchel in black and personally kate spade has to be the brand that i love their purses from the most so since it is a satchel it does come with the little handles to carry it like a purse but it also comes with this longer strap which is why i was actually drawn to purchase it because i personally love crossbody bags but i also was in need of like a bigger purse to carry more things in and so i thought that this was the perfect one and this purse is not leather i know the straps are leather but the rest is a different type of material and it does have three different zippers so it has one right here and then it has the main zipper and then it also has one in the back right here. This is actually a smaller pouch, but all together it has four compartments because right here it has like a magnetic part, but it does open up so I can store stuff in here as well. So I guess I'll just start off by showing you guys what I have on the outside of my purse. So right here I have a keychain attached that my sister actually gifted to me for Christmas. It has a picture of my dog, Lucky. And then this heart says, you are always in my heart and then this little paw print, which I thought was so cute. And then I attach this hand sanitizer, which my friend Bethel actually gave me as a birthday gift. And I just thought it was so me. This is like a little Polaroid camera. And as you guys know, I love to film videos and do photography. So I think this describes me really well. And in case anyone's interested, the scent of my hand sanitizer is coconut macaroon. So yeah, the scent of my hand sanitizer is actually really unique, but it actually smells really good. And I actually would always carry around a small bottle of hand sanitizer on any of my purses long before coronavirus. So now moving along, I'm gonna open up the first zipper right here. And in the zipper, I don't have much in it. I actually just have my house keys. So I do have them color coordinated so I know which key is for what door. And I really love the keychain that I have on it. So I got this keychain with my initial during my last trip to Disney World. And so I have my keys in this zipper just for easy grab. And I also throw my car keys in here whenever I go out. So now moving on to the next section. This is the one that is like magnetic. So you literally just pull it out and it unclips and then it just closes as you guys heard. So in this part of the bag, I actually just keep my mask. So I usually have two, but right now I have one. And as you guys can see, I have been putting my mask in like this little pouch. I used to just throw it in my purse, but I realized like how unsanitary that is. Not only is it like bad because I'm putting it on my face, but also I feel like it dirties my purse or like anything that is inside of it. So I've just been throwing them in here. I think it's really easy to just, you know, you put it in here, throw it in your purse and it stays clean. So you don't have to worry about like putting on a dirty mask on your face. So like I mentioned earlier, I do carry two in here. And I also think that this is just really easy to like open up right before I go into a store or something and just put on my mask. So now we're gonna be going into the main compartment of the bag. So in this part of my bag, I like to keep it pretty organized as you guys just saw. And I think that this bag is pretty spacious, so I do have quite a few things in here. I'm just gonna start off by showing you guys what I keep in these small pouches inside of this section. So in the first section, I keep all of my lip products and I always carry around lip balm or chapstick. So the first one that I have is just this one by Blitzfex in the scent Medicated Berry. And then I also carry around this lip balm by ColourPop. This is from the Coco Logo collection. And lastly, I keep this lip gloss by Maybelline. It is the new lifter gloss. 
and this is actually in the shade 004 Silk. I love this lip gloss and I cannot recommend it enough. So all these smaller pouches are a little bit tighter so not much fits in them but thankfully there are two. So in the second one I have this travel size deodorant. The one that I currently have is by the brand Dove and it is in the scent Cucumber. And then I will also throw in this contact lens container. I do have an extra one so I always like to carry one in my purse just in case there's something like ever in my eyes that's bothering me and I have to take on my lenses so I like to keep this in my purse and lastly I like to keep a hair tie and a scrunchie as a girl these are very essential so I always like to keep more than one in my purse just in case I lose one it rips or my sister needs an extra one so these are always in my purse so now going into the main compartment of course I keep my wallet and this wallet is actually from coach I think it's super pretty I love the detailing inside it has such a pretty pattern and I actually got this like two years ago during their Valentine's sale so this is part of a collection I thought it was super pretty and then I also keep a lotion in here this is from Ulta this is in the scent frosted fairy so I have to make sure to always keep some lotion with me especially with the cold in Chicago my hands always get dry and we don't want ashy hands so I try to keep this one with me I also really love the scent of it this one is pretty big so I usually keep like a smaller bottle from Bath and Body Works but my friend gave me this one for my birthday and so I've been using this one all right so next in here I have my earphones these are the wireless ones by beats and i don't use these a lot because when i'm out with people like i feel like it's rude to put on earphones but sometimes when my family and i go on a long drive somewhere and i want to listen to my own music i'll use my earphones so they're very important as well and then next i carry around this and you guys might be wondering what it is but this is actually a portable charger so it is pretty big it's looks like this um, but it has a really long battery life which I really love and I just keep it in the pouch because I think it's the safest in here the good thing is that it is really thin if you guys are interested I will have it linked down below I got it from Amazon and lastly I have my little makeup pouch so the bag itself I believe is from Target I did receive it as a gift and in here I just have a couple of makeup essentials so I always have a pack of tissue paper I already opened it <laughs> and then this is kind of random but I keep a nail file around with me because sometimes my nails will like chip and if I don't file them right away they'll just like break off really badly so I keep this in here as well and then I also have a travel size mascara this is by Maybelline and it is called the falsies and to go along with that I have a little eyelash curler this is actually smaller than the one that I usually use here at home so this is perfect it looks like it's travel size in a way and then I carry around this little blush this is by milk makeup and it is in the shade work and then I also have this travel size lipstick by Mac this is in the shade velvet teddy it's just like the perfect neutral everyday lipstick shade and so I love carrying this with me and then I also have this roller perfume so this is by Shawn Mendes I believe he released this collection like two to three years ago and this smells so good I also really like that it's for both genders so both male and female can wear it and I just love it so much like I can smell this all day and yes I've been having it for two to three years and I still have quite a lot in it because I don't want to use it all up the full-size bottle is almost finished and this is like all I have left so I'm trying to save this for as long as I can and then lastly I'll just keep some feminine products in here as well so I forgot to mention but there actually is a little like small zipper pouch in here as well so as you guys can see it's right here right above the Kate Spade logo and I currently don't have much in that zipper. I just have this little compact mirror that's by Revlon. So this is definitely another essential. And lastly, this little pouch here in the back is actually pretty small. Not much can fit in here, like it only goes halfway. But I just like to keep my phone in here. I think it's good for safekeeping and it's also really accessible. So yeah, that is all that I have in my purse. I don't like to keep much in there because then I feel like it's really stuffed and it's really hard to find things. It also feels like heavy to carry. So I just keep the essentials in there. And I also wanted to mention one more thing before I close out this video. So as I mentioned, this is a satchel purse. But this longer strap can actually be removed if you would like. So you just clip it off and then it's more of like a purse. I love crossbody bags so 
I usually keep this strap on here. If you guys like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to turn on my post notifications so that you're notified when my next video goes up. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!